Good morning, guys. So it's almost 8 a.m. in the morning, and somehow my sister over here um, convinced me and my parents to go on a day trip. It didn't take much convincing. Yeah, that's true. I was like, let's go. And then <laughs> everyone's like, huh? <gasps> so somehow, like, she just caught our attention like that, and we're going on a day trip to Vegas, which is a little crazy because this is gonna be like the shortest trip we have ever taken at least so far and we just realized like the travel part's actually going to take half as much time as we're actually going to be in vegas our flight is at 10 and the flight coming back is tonight at 11. yeah i'm gonna be so tired bro like i could barely sleep last night because it was so loud but um yeah we're gonna head out now wow i sound really like morning voice i just stand on this all day yeah it feels like we're like Floating. This is definitely my favorite part. Hi. Whoop. Fly that face. Hi. Me too. <laughs> Woo. Yo, Lelu, we're back. <laughs> we're back again. Okay, so we have maybe, are we like halfway into the flight? I was wondering if you wanted to play a game of who's more likely to. Yes. Okay, so I guess we each come up with a question. Who's more likely to survive in Jurassic Park? Ready? One, two, three. Really? I don't know. I, th I think it's you because I like, I can't run at all either. Yeah, maybe not you. <laughs> Yeah, I'll be the first to go away. I will um, go away too, but... <laughs> but you're more likely to survive. Who's most likely to give a stranger a ph your phone number? Oh my gosh, ready? One, two, three... <laughs> really? I think, I, think it'll, I think it'll be an accident though. How? Like if somebody's be like, oh, uh, and then I'll... It's like if somebody asks you and then you like don't know how to say no. So like a guy? Uh, okay then no I won't. <laughs> then maybe it's you. Who's more likely to embarrass themselves in public? One, two, three. Both? Both? No, you can only choose one. I'm always embarrassing though. I you always find myself embarrassing. She thinks she's always embarrassing. I think I'm always embarrassing. I don't know. Mm, we danced in public public in cow costumes. Oh, uh, that's true. Okay, then. That, this one's a tie. Who's most likely to faint in skydiving? Oh my god, I already know this. I already know this answer. Me too. <laughs> one, two, three. <laughs> it's me. It's definitely me. She wants She wants to jump off the strat, and I'm like afraid to do that, and that's like to, controlled not this time. time. Not this time, though, because we don't have time for that. Who's more likely to travel to a foreign country by themselves? I really don't know for this one. Okay, ready? One, two, three. I don't know. It could be both. You know. Who's most likely to drop something on the floor and eat it? Oh, I think I know this one. One, two, three. What? <coughs> I feel like everyone's done that before though. There's a three second rule. Which in your case, it seems like a five second rule. What do you mean? <laughs> you just wash it and eat it. See? Yeah, it's Allie. It's definitely Allie. Like, rinse it off. <laughs> yes. Alright, then you already got three. Okay, anyways, there's gonna be another like hour of flight. I might take a nap. What are you doing? I don't know. I'm bored. At least we got water. But Ali didn't ask for water and then she started drinking mine. <laughs> the lady walked away. Yeah, it's true. So I literally just said we have another hour of flight and apparently we're already almost landing. Now that's one embarrassing thing I just did in public. Y'alls, I like, oh my god, um, there's there's turbulence and I am like freaking out <laughs> I'm not freaking out but I don't like I don't I don't like the feeling and I'm like sweating and Allie's enjoying it what do you mean? what are you talking about? check out her part for the worst part of the turbulence because she oh my goodness she captured it 
Yeah, I like traveling, but I really am nervous on planes. This is the worst turbulence we've been in. Yeah. We're about to land. Allie! <laughs> okay. A bumpy one. How are you? I'm starting to get a little motion sick. <laughs> Me too. So good thing we're like here already. Yeah, because that was like if a lot bumpier than if that went on for another like 15 minutes. Uh-oh. I think we'll be both using the little doggy bag. Okay, so we made it to uh, Vegas and we're like lost in the airport and we're trying to find our way out because it's different from where we came from last time so we're very confused are we gonna go up we don't know where we are we're so lost we're going back down the escalator so after a like 15 minute debate on where we're gonna go eat we have decided to go to get dim sum so last time we were here it was about six months ago and I learned from a mistake, bring a mic, because otherwise you can't hear my voice at all. So this is gonna be our lunch today, and then we're gonna have dinner later at the crawfish place that we had last time, because last time my parents weren't able to come. That was one of the places that they really wanted to go to. You say this place, they don't have a ton of options. I think all their food is really good. Oh my gosh, we are devouring the food like monsters because it's like one comes out and we finish it and we're just waiting for the next one. Fried milk, oh my god. Last time I came here, this was my favorite. Anyways, I'm gonna finish eating and then we're gonna go around and walk a little bit, but we don't really have a plan. And I'm sweating a lot. See you later. So we just finished eating and we're basically just taking our parents around to um, explore Vegas. And the first place they decided they wanted to go to was Venetian. So this is where we are right now and I still kind of want to go on that boat. But I don't think I will. Maybe next time because we don't really have a lot of time today since we're only going to be here for a little less than 12 hours. They're on the other side. I found the other bridge and I'm going to like try to take a picture of my parents right now. And they're right there with my sister. Super tiny. Ah, ice cream. And then I think I might do the single scoop vanilla on a plain cone. Thank you. So last time Ali ate a ton of coccolini and this time we're actually gonna try something else. But I went with the very basic vanilla on a plain cone because I am basic like that. I had like ice cream. It's already half gone. Oh my goodness. <laughs> and then dad got one with sprinkles. And then Ali got a different cone with sprinkles. I'm the only basic one here. They go shiko hosek ma. Hosek. She got the vanilla with a cone with. I think like nuts on the side. Yeah, she's excited for the crawfish. So I think that's like the only thing that she's like super excited about this entire time is eating and eating and eating and then crawfish. So I've only been here for like a few hours and I already can tell you that I like the winter weather a lot more than right now because my mom just told me my face is red and I don't really get red easily and I am really sweating. Winter weather, like, although it, like, rains, but I guess last time when we were here, we got lucky and it wasn't raining that much. So maybe if it rains, then I wouldn't like it either. Next time I should try, like, spring or, like, fall. They're not tired yet. So this, it's about 3 o'clock. I don't know how loud the music is, but we're taking a break. My bag is getting heavy. It's not even heavy, but I've been carrying it for too long. My camera is really heavy. Okay, well, I kind of want to sit. It's so nice. Oh my god, I'm getting wet. But it's so nice that this place has um, little water spritzing out because it makes it so much cooler. I really need to sit down and drink water. I'm dying of heat. Oh yeah. Paris. 
，我哋上次住嗰度咯。我哋可以入去嗰度揾地方坐下。可以啊。So we are back at the uh 33rd floor of Paris, and honestly, I didn't really think that we were going to be back here. Let alone it being a day trip, but it's nice to like revisit a lot of the places again. We're actually gonna go sit down for a little bit because I think everyone is kind of tired a little bit. We're gonna also rehydrate before we go back into the sun. But I'm not gonna lie, after sitting down for a little bit, my my knees are starting to hurt and my calves are starting to hurt. So I think tomorrow is gonna be a really bad day, but then I think it's also okay because I'm not really doing anything tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> this is the second time I dropped my mic today. You guys, after a long day of walking around, we have finally arrived at the hot and juicy crawfish that I think everybody has been looking forward to all day. Um, so I'm very excited to finally eat because I am so excited. I don't have a good angle, but it's gonna have to do. Um, can we get the drool pound of the frozen crawfish as well? Hot and juicy is going to be our most popular flavor, and then our medium is like a six to eight out of ten. Can we do maybe like a five? A five? Yeah. Uh, medium okay? Medium, yeah. Okay. And then hot and juicy okay as well? Uh, yeah. Uh, spicy. Spicy? Yeah, we are laughing. Thank you. I'm going to use it this time. Last time I didn't use it, but this time I'm going to use it because I'm wearing all white. This is a lot of food. Whoa. Yo, look at how big this is. No crab legs. Look at the mess we made. So we just finished eating the crawfish. She's been looking forward to it ever since we told her about it about half a year ago. And she finally has a chance to come and eat it. I know that like I think Ali said SJ also has like crawfish where you can eat like that. But also she also kind of wanted to come here and she hasn't been on a plane in a while so we decided that it's good to what? In a while. In a long time, right? Years? Mom. Uh, yeah. Yeah, so then we decided that we'd get it all done at once. So she's very happy and satisfied. So am I. I don't know why, but for some reason, we really like um, see-through elevators. Elevators. All right. That was short. Okay, so we're basically just um, in front of Bellagio and we're waiting for the water show because my parents kind of want to see it. Look at how sweaty my face is. Oh my goodness. It feels great. So that show lasted like one song length of time, but it was the coolest wind I have felt all day. I'm just sitting on the floor at this point. I'm so tired. I'm not gonna lie, my sweat's actually hurting my under eye over here a little bit. So I don't know, I don't know why, but it kind of just stings. Oh my god, dude, I wanted to come back for a jacket and they don't have the size 4 anymore. Seriously? Yeah. The black one? Yeah. Because I don't really want white, even though white looks good, because if you fall on the ice, it might get dirty. Oh well. Hey guys, so finally we're at the airport and I'm super ready to go home. And honestly, I think like we didn't really end up doing much except for eating and walking around in the scorching heat. And honestly, this has been quite an experience to just be here for like less than 12 hours. To honestly just revisit some of the places that I've been like half a year ago with my parents this time. I hope they had a fun time, I know I did. But this is going to be the end of the video, I hope you enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to drop a like, comment, and subscribe if you want. And don't forget to check out my sister's channel. The link will be in the description box down below. And I will see you in my next video. Bye! You know what? Whatever. <laughs> okay, now we have to